Deborah Stone is a Professor Emerita at the Heller School of Social Policy and Management at Brandeis University. She has previously worked at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology and Dartmouth College, and she has taught and conducted research on health and social policy, the welfare state and political decision-making at a number of American universities. Deborah Stone is widely recognised as one of the world's leading researchers in the fields of political policy-making and health policy. Her research has been pivotal in helping researchers around the globe become aware of the importance of narratives, metaphors and figures in political debates and processes. I don't think of my work as doing research so much as playing with ideas. I don't start with a theoretical framework and I don't use fancy methods. I let gut feelings and intuitions generate puzzles. One of my most meaningful projects was helping to create a public policy think tank in Nepal, precisely because it's so different that it challenged everything I had taken for granted about foreign aid and domestic policy making. I think if we use that definition, then, then Deborah Stone is the smartest person that I've ever met. <laughs> My work centers on health policy, primarily health insurance, disability policy, and care work. I try to persuade people that taking care of one another isn't just good for public health, it's good for the health of the polity. I try to show why altruism can be a better engine of social progress than the self-interest that's so central to economics. And local officials knew whether people were black and white, and they filled out a form and they by Undoubtedly, my greatest impact has been as a teacher through my textbook, Policy Paradox. It's not a traditional textbook. Rather, it challenges the dominant way of thinking about policy analysis as something that should be scientific, objective, and value-free. I tell students, you don't have to check your values at the door to be a good policy analyst. The book shows them how the major analytical concepts of the field, such as efficiency and equity, are not neutral. They already have values built into them, and it's our job as analysts to tease them out. In the time I've spent at Aarhus University, there's no question that I got more than I gave. The students taught me to feel more shocked than I already was by U.S. history. I've had some very fruitful research collaborations, and some faculty are now among my trusted first readers and also good friends. But most of all, I treasure the warmth and friendliness of the political science department. Professor Deborah Stone is an old and very dear friend of the faculty. Deborah will always be associated with her extremely influential book, Policy Paradox, The Art of Political Decision Making. The book has been standard textbook reading in public policy for more than 30 years now. I would like to highlight Deborah's work on the German healthcare. It was a great inspiration to me when I wrote my PhD some years ago. I'm very happy that Deborah has accepted to become honorary doctorate at Aarhus University. I first met Deborah Stone in 2010 when she was a guest professor in this department. Her books are sort of unlike anything else in political science because she doesn't present any fancy statistics or models. She sort of just explains how it is. What I learned from that is caring very much about the content of public policy and also caring about writing well in academia, which I think is worth honoring.